Let's talk about the frog life cycle. Frogs lay their eggs in a gelatinous mass called frog spawn. Um, these eggs then develop into tadpoles, and those tadpoles are going to start forming a tail and gills. That's how they breathe within water. So once those are formed, that egg mass is, is broken and these little tadpoles are released. Um, they have no front legs or no rear legs at that point, just a tail and gills to breathe from. The next step in the frog life cycle is to develop front legs. Um, when that occurs, that's when they start generally resorbing this tail. During that time, depending on the species, as the tail is being abs absorbed, the rear legs then developed. They are actually using this tail as a nutrient base and so they're surviving off of their tail. Once that tail is almost fully resorbed, that's when these guys then become sub-adult frogs and start feeding off of anything living. With most species, we're talking about insect eaters. And that tail then fully gets resorbed. That's why they're in the family called, or order, sorry, called a neuro, which means without tail. And then that there, that is when they are an adult frog.